So you might be in a position where you want to set up a daily reminder on your iPhone. Now there's a few different ways to do this. You can do this within Siri or you can do this within the reminders application. So let's say I want to make up a reminder of picking up food every day. Well, what I can do is I can hold down Siri so I can get into Siri and I can tell her set a daily reminder to pick up food every day. Now nine times out of 10, it's not going to work. So we'll go and try it out here. Set a daily reminder to pick up food every day. And it actually ended up working out pretty well. So as you can see, that is one way to do it. I've had very weird success with this. Sometimes it doesn't work at all, but in this case, it actually ended up working out. So that is really good. So you can just end up doing that. Now, instead of doing it with Siri, what you can also do is you can go ahead and get into reminders right here. I will go ahead and delete this reminder that I have set up. And what I can do is click at the bottom and click new reminder. And what we want to do is we want to go and put in, and what we want to do is we want to put in exactly whatever we want to do. So here I can just go and type in pick up food. Now at the very bottom here, you'll see this little calendar icon. What you want to do is click on that calendar icon and here it's going to allow you to pretty much pick up, you know, and change the date and time and all that stuff. So what I do is I click date and time. This little option will come up and at the very bottom, you can choose whether there's a time you want to go and get associated with it as well. But at the bottom where it says repeat, you want to go and click here and you want to go and click daily. Now you can also set it up if you want it weekdays or whatever the case is. In this case, we'll just set it up for daily and you can have it to end the repeat too. Let's say you only want it for the next month. We can go ahead and just you know put the date if you want to to end it. In this case, we won't. And that is pretty much how to do it. You click apply and you pretty much have the exact same thing as we had before. So this is more likelihood of success, but the other one still works too. So if you want to delete it as well, you can swipe to the side and delete it. That's pretty much how to do it. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, know me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.